Jillian Rich, she is a board member with Winter Kids joining us here on set. Good morning to you. Thanks great. for being here. Thanks for having me. Uh, lovely to have you here. And uh, it's great to talk about this event because this, this is a huge event. And, uh, you know, we just finished up with the Charity Summit. But this one is looking for even bigger numbers. Let's talk about Winter Kids and the Downhill 24. Yeah, it's a wonderful event. And this year it kicks off on... February 29th, which is kind of fun, um, at 8 p.m. And it's one of the only times you get to ski under the lights at Sugarloaf. Yeah. It's a 24-hour event. Um, we're expecting around 600 participants, a sellout event this year. Um, hoping it's already sold out? We're getting there. We're getting oh, close. There's okay. still time to register teams. and Get on that site now. Yeah, if you go to d24.org, you can learn about volunteering at the event if you're interested or signing up and registering teams. We have kids' divisions, um, skiing, snowboarding. You can skin up the mountain. You can ski down the mountain under the lights. It's just, it's pretty magical, especially at sunrise. Are you on a team? I am on a team. Yeah, what's your team? My team is Team Apre, actually. Team Apre. <laughs> yes. I like it. I like it. And then uh, I know that it, it gets pretty... It gets pretty competitive, some of the teams. It is competitive, yeah. There's different areas where you can earn points um, between fundraising, how many times you s skin up or ski down or snowboard down the mountain. Um, you can do all of that. There's costume contests. There's an indoor inflatable race course. Various ways that you can get your team together if you're a biz local business or someone that wants to um, you know, get your employees together and really... Yeah. Just embrace winter and you know celebrate it and raise some money for kids and families. The so, ultimate team building. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What a great cause. And uh, Winter Kids, the organization, boy, it, it it has gotten over the years much more involved and and, and demographically, it's just Maine right now. Is that correct? We, yeah, they are, there are kids throughout Maine that just participated in the Winter Games throughout some of their schools, and that was a wonderful event where they were build, building snow sculptures and doing all kinds of activities. Um, and then throughout, there's also the Winter Kids app, which is used throughout various states, and there's an outdoor learning guide as well um, that hits states all over the country. Uh, Maine, you know, New Hampshire, Vermont, there's states in Michigan and Minnesota, there's kids using these things. Uh, which is really great just to get kids and families outside yeah. um, and moving their bodies throughout the winter. We were just on the website which, watching the kids on the podium. Yeah. yeah. How, how cool is that? Now that website really gives you all the great information that you need, right? It does. It's got everything on there. You can learn about how to download the app. You can learn about, if you go to d24.org specifically, you can learn all about the Downhill 24 event, mm -hmm. how to register a team, how to sponsor um, or donate to a team if you know um, a team that's already out there, mm -hmm. and then just learn more about the event. We're really excited for this year. And it's for everyone. It's a family event. It's that's a, a great thing. Yeah. There's other activities as well, right? There's a lot going on throughout. There's different, um, like there's sunrise breakfast, and there's you know lots of activities throughout for the family and the kids, um, and you know, and then the teams that are racing and are not really racing, but earning, you know, right. doing laps on the mountain and um, you know trying to get those points. And watching the kids teams is also a lot of fun too. They do a great job with the costume contests. Right. Right. Uh, again, go to the website. You can find out more information, and uh, we, we appreciate you coming and sharing that with us, and we're looking forward to this event. And do you have a goal this year that you're hoping to hit? We're hoping to raise around $800,000 this around year. Around 800 Yes. Yeah. And uh, I'm sure that you have some many sponsors, but probably some that you might want to do a shout-out, huh? Yeah, so it's our 12th annual Downhill 24, and our two presenting sponsors are Zachow Construction and Agron. And they are, uh, they probably got teams too. They do. They yeah. got very competitive teams each year. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's going to be a fun time, and uh, everyone is welcome. Go to the website and find out more information. Uh, Jillian Rich, thank you so much yes, for joining us. Yes, thank you. I appreciate it. We appreciate you joining us as well. We'll take a break, and we'll be back with more here on the Mountain Report.